Okay, so <clears throat> this is a test environment for Flarm and Fanet. So we have a Skytrax beacon, which is uh, sending and receiving Fanet and transmitting also Flarm. We have a GXRCOM that is set to only send and receive Flarm, so no Fanet for the way it has been set. We have a 7.3 plus V1, so similar to the beacon, which means that it's transmitting and receiving Fanet and it is transmitting Flarm. And here we can see that we can have the three Fanet device signals. Then we have a 7.3 plus V2. So with the module that can send and receive Fanet, send and receive Flarm. And we can see actually that we receive the three Fanet device as well as the Flarm from the second 7.3 plus that I will show you just later and the Flarm from the um, GXRCOM. Uh, of course we do not receive the Beacon Flarm and the V1 Flarm because when a device sends both Fanet and Flarm it privileges the Fanet signal. Here we have uh, the 7.3 plus V2, but with uh, XA track instead of XA guide, um, activating the module. And we actually see that there are also four devices received. And so basically, this is the four device sending FLARM because this is the GXRCOM web page showing that it is receiving the four different FLARM signals from the other device. So we have the Skytrax beacon, we have the 7.3 plus V1, we have the 7.3 plus V2 with XA guide and 7.3 plus V2 with XA track.